let's start this up. Let's just go ahead and do a new game. Slot two. Yep. This is a quick calibration procedure to optimize your playing experience. So yeah, I've checked this out before. It's pretty cool. Um, just wanted to showcase it off, show everybody what it's all about. It's kind of like a sleeper title. Press the menu button to continue. Uh, the there we go. Congratulations, recruit, in finishing your basic training. Before you leave to the Twin Planet system, I'm going to help you get used to this Triple O tactical suit, which has the ability to adapt to most environments you will encounter. Let's get started. Okay, here we go. Our soldier needs to be able to move with agility. Mm -hmm. The suit will boost your speed and strength. Use your left joystick to move forward. Got it. Use your right joystick to turn. Yep, 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 yep. I prefer the snap. Snap seems to work better. I don't know what Use it. your right joystick to turn. Yep, did that. Okay. Man, this game looks great. Sometimes you will need that extra speed boost to reach certain places. And then run. Try reaching the door before it closes. You can sprint by pre Well done. You have made it on time. Now go field. stand on the red tile. Now press A to jump. Jump in. Try jumping over the gaps while walking towards them. You can jump further by holding the A button longer. These gaps are bigger, so try jumping while sprinting towards them. Not all heights are reachable by simply jumping onto them. Oh, sorry about climbing the will be just as important. All by right. using the side button, you can grab ledges and climb. You can climb on top by moving one or both controllers oh, down in a push go. motion while pressing the grab button. You can also grab ledges while jumping towards them. And up we go, and we're through that. Another barrier you will have to overcome, navigating in and underwater. Don't worry about oxygen, your suit is adapted to provide it in any environment. Swimming is straightforward, you move in the opposite direction of the palms of your hands. Jump in the water. Yeah, this is pretty and much like swimming. swimming. Movements. Granted, I probably move your hands up dog, and down to paddling, move upwards or downwards. There we go. Yep. Up, down. Up, up, up. And move your hands up or down to move upwards Ow. or downwards. Your suit is equipped with a hollow backpack. It can transform matter into data and materialize it again when you grab it back. Please pick up these three batteries and two food items by using the side buttons. Then drop them behind one of your shoulders to put them in your backpack. Well done. Now grab all the other objects. You can take the last added food item from your backpack by grabbing it over your right shoulder. You can take the last other object from your backpack by grabbing it over That's your left shoulder. That's an ugly looking fruit. I, I wonder what it would taste like in real life. Kind of like a pomegranate pear or something. Ugh. So how do I eat it? What am I supposed to do? Jump with it, yes. Let's just jump around holding a pear. You can take the last other object from your backpack by grabbing it over your left shoulder. Take a look at the top of your left wrist. Mm -hmm. You can see a big triple O logo on there. The percentage on it tells you what the energy level of your suit is. As your suit is connected to your body, eating or drinking will raise the energy level. Now, take a food item out of your backpack by grabbing it over your right shoulder and eat it by holding it in front of your mouth. Good, like your energy level is at 100% again. 
Now, look at your left wrist again yep. and tap on the Triple O logo. Let me check the chats real quick. Look at your left wrist again and tap on the Triple O logo. Uh -huh. Okay. Your inventory will open and you can now take objects directly from it. Now put a battery in the red slot to disable the force field. Well done. Continue and open the last door. All right, let's get a run and jump going. Oh, caught it. Yeah. I am in no way able to do that in real life. I would fall on my face hard. All right, let's put another one over here. We're running down, boys. You will have to this learn cool. to defend yourself. Pick up the gun over there. By pressing B, grips, you can equip or unequip your gun. So Try hitting as many targets as possible within the time limit to pass your final assessment. When the gun is empty, you can recharge the gun's battery by holding oh. it upwards beside your head. The longer you hold it, the faster it will recharge. Oh, this recharges it? Okay. Done, recruit. Was great to wrap up your training, you will be sent to the Twin Planet System. Walk towards the end of the room and board your spacecraft. For the right. journey ahead, you won't be needing any weapons, as you will be escorted by far more experienced and trained soldiers. I can see what you're saying. I can peek through Please my nose hole. Please take your place in your sleeping pod. Make yourself comfortable, because it will be a long I trip. Last time. So I'm going to... Kind of just back into it. How do I sound? Can you hear me all right? Oh, good. Doesn't sound like I'm in a tin can or anything. What? Look at that planet smashing. All those little round balls. What am I doing? Good morning, here? recruit. I'm Lucia, the pilot of this triple O ship. Before I unlock your sleeping cabin, I'm going to give you a short. Does this game update. look sick or what? We have just left light speed to enter the twin planet system. Still several hours away from your drop off point, the intergalactic harbor on the Hello. planet where you. Let me check your data. I wonder if that's the person talking to become or if that's an the... agent of the order of objectivity. Uh, somebody else. Well, believe me, there are worse places to be trained than Maybe the it capital is. of temptation. Anyway, I'm going to unlock your cabin now. Before you rush out, be aware you have been asleep for nine days, so movement oh, can feel strange. Nine days for a while. sleep sounds restful. What is ducking? I can move it closer too. Like this. I could probably also change the audio to the audio output from the game to the Oculus. If I can reach that. Uh, hold on. Attention, it's, we're receiving a code nine yeah, message from the command on. ship. Holographic message coming up. One second, technical difficulties. Oh, it's a bald man. Triple O members aboard Transport Vessel M O G. Roll, 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 roll. We received the emergency call from a dwarf planet, which your ship is passing by at this very moment. He's so British. Due to the fact that none of my agents are close He's like a VR version of the guy from Wallace and Gromit. Oh no, no. We're going after the chief. Special Force Commander. To go down and cheat. She has teeth. 
of Seleucia. They're so far from landing. Oh, oh man, he's, he's nightmarish. Troopers, it's a cool coat, though. Land from the planet, go in search for special agent Sire. He sounds like he needs a new mic. Your contact. Since you sent a message from one of the drones. It's Jeff Bezos. <laughs> yes, Daddy Bezos. Or even Dad. Jeffrey, alive, Jeffrey Bezos. You can have to help her finish what she started. No. Maybe Run from the ball, man. <laughs> ah. Go and succeed. Help, I need an adult. So, recruit troopers, you heard the commander. The Forget commander. about the pleasure domes on the pillar planet. Here we, we are on the Amazon Prime Express. Buffalo. We're going down. Looks like his voice is putting himself. <laughs> Looks like his voice is putting himself to sleep. Oh man! Well, something bad's happening. My hands are vibrating, and it's not because I drink too much caffeine. It's the controllers. Oh, we're in red mode. What? No. Hold on. Hold on to what? I'm in a room with no handles. I'm just gonna stand still, I guess. Ugh. Loading, loading. Alright, I am gonna take a moment to, like, pop the audio into my headphones instead. Oh, recruit, you're still alive. Right. Follow me. Two, I can use some help. Two seconds. Where's my mouse? I lost it. There it is. Okay, let's drop it into there. Alright, so that should take care of the background sound. You guys can still hear me. Can you hear the game? Yellow card. Yellow card for what? I, uh, you see those batteries over there? Yeah. Take one and I'll put it in three. your backpack. Okay. Let's hurry up. We're underwater. We're good. Water now dancing. follow me outside. We're doing old people aerobics. It's probably really what. So, those things look like a problem. Let's get out of the water. I don't trust alien worlds in water. Listen carefully. Yeah, I'm listening. You see that recon drone over there? On top of that rock. I tried to reactivate it, but the battery is wasted. So if you can climb out of the water and put a new battery in, then I can re-enter the ship and try to connect to the drone from there. I shall do this. Who is calling? Oh. Never mind. Um. Great, you did it. Sorry, I bumped the microphone. My turn now. It's like two inches from my face. Let me, uh... Let me... There we go. Okay, you do that. Uh, I don't have any delays. Yes, so otherwise it works. I, work for something I can control the drone done. remotely now. While you are unconscious, those two troopers already mm. left the ship and went looking for the spaceport. No, no, no. I suggest you follow them. Okay, I'll lead the way. Recruit, follow me. I mean, the drone. <laughs> Avoid swimming in the water as much as possible. I tried blasting these squids, but my energy blasters seem to have no effect on these species. Best to avoid them for now. You probably wonder why we ended up in the water. No. Nope. Well, I was flying towards the spaceport when a little ship took off without warning and flew straight towards us. Sorry about the microphone. So just before landing, I had to change course and not crash into them. And here we are. The good news is the ship is not severely damaged. So, while you and the troopers are looking for Cyana, I'll try to pump out the water and get the ship going again. Good. Let's hope yeah. those terraformers don't wake up before I finish the job, so I can pick you all up. I don't think this Assuming plan is Assuming we find Agent Cyana, and she's alive. Whoever that is. Alright, so now I'm going to take a back up from the microphone. I don't need a VR rig where I can run around. This game, I'm sitting down just fine. It's working out. 
I got a lot of stuff down here in the room. Um, Alright, hold on. Oh, I'm gonna reach. There we go. Human hands aren't meant to go that way. So this game has like a lot of like climbing stuff, but it's also really cool for other whoa. I don't know what happened there on that. I'm just trying to like there we go. Oh. Oh, whew. I wish I could like or oh, I guess I'll just turn my whole body to make it easier. I'm trying to like do this like front facing. Um down we go. Hear the wind blowing. Apparently, it's doing the same thing outside here, too. Nope. Fail. You probably wonder why we ended up in the water. Well, Have one I was what? flying towards the spaceport when a little ship took off without warning and flew straight towards Sorry. us. So just before landing, I had to change course and not crash into them. And here we are. I have two at the house here. The good news is we the ship play, uh, is not severely damaged. We could play Among Us in VR. So, while you and the troopers Both are looking for Cyana, you I'll try sign to pump in on up the, other the water computer and get the ship going again. Do that. Let's hope those terraformers don't wake up before I finish the job, so I can pick you all oh, up. Oh, I have a treadmill, but... Uh, Assuming you find Agent Cyanna really and she's that for alive. This. Like, if you want to run around, that's, that's, that's cool for you, man, but I'll pass. Alright, turning myself, orienting, orienting. Let's go. Come on. That cable is clearly made from some organic substance. Oh. You know what? I bet the Triple O database can tell us more. Well, all right. Scan and send. Yeah, we'll find out what this thing is shortly, I believe. And... Could you imagine, like, having a drone that you can control this way, and it's just like like a little robot that you control with VR? That'd be cool. Um, how do I get my gun? Nope, nope, nope. That's Crouch. That's good to know. Alright, I gotta turn around and see what... Oh. What, what, what's with the... What's with the sad smiley faces? The little goo... The goo men. What's with the goo men? Aye. What's with the goo men? Alright, recruit. I got hit. Apparently these squids are hunted for their special energy resistant body fluid. Looks Ew. like the poachers that were harvesting them abandoned all their gear and left. I wonder so, what this device is used for. Two squids equal whatever Let's that thing this is. Out. And then it gets grinded up squid in the Squid arms go in, something comes out. Alright, squid arms go in and something comes out. <laughs> uh, oh, there that we looks go. like a torpedo gun. Let's get out there and hunt some squids and bring back some arms. Didn't you pay attention during your weapon course? Torpedo guns can only be used underwater. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All 
Alright, well, I see one straight ahead, so we're gonna... There's three. I have a feeling these guys are not friendly for the most part. Okay. That's two. Three. Alright, let's go get those arms. These guys are probably going to try to attack me once I get close to get his friend's hand. Kapow! Chow! Alright, can I get more than just two? No, you don't. Maybe, maybe I can cause a mass extinction if these guys are rare. Little fishies. Blub, blub, blub. Dead squid. <laughs> this is dead squid. We're on the USS Ishimura. What you think you're doing there, Chief? Pop! This thing's like way overpowered. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's head back. That's enough putzing around out here. Arms are going all higgity piggity. I don't know what that is, but I'll grab them. Let me let me grab them. Wait. What is that? No, I'm not going to break it back. I'm going to. Blink-182 in May. That should be fun. Alright, let's see what these squid things do. Put them in the meat grinder. <laughs> oh, that, that, that's just, that's just nasty. I'm not going to say anything, but this, uh... <laughs> Ooh. Hey, how about that? We got the next, uh, got the next... What the hell are they called? Fidget spinners. We got the next fidget spinner right This here. cave is clearly the fastest way to the spaceport. Some, there we go. There must be a way to cross this gap. Well... Good job. What about throwing it to the other energy panel over there? All right, I gotta make sure I'm not gonna hit anything when I throw it. Ready? Yeah! Sweet! And now we have a rope. That thing was way stretchier than it felt like it was going to be. This is like such an adventure. I'm getting such an arm workout. I'm, I'm not gonna push out cool luck things. by diving into the water. So I'm gonna look for another way. Yeah, leave me to so go see fight more squid side. underwater.
Oh, she's, she's. Ooh, nice catch. Uh, oh. Got like short arms going on here or something. Dang. Nope. Oh. Okay. There we go. There was stuff in this box I wanted to look up. Whatever the heck that is. What is this? It's a shiny rock. I have a shiny rock. Can you hear the game audio as well? Just checking. What the heck was that? Who's... Oh, un momento. What the world was that? Uh, 3,000 pounds of meat recalled over possible E. coli. Uh, what else? Uh, Stonehenge calendar shows to be a modern construct. Okay. Thanks for interrupting my gameplay news. Okay, so how do I get that gun? There it is. Nothing behind me. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm getting more headlines. I, they, they, my phone's blowing up. All done. Enough of that BS. Mr. Squidward Tentacles. Oh, Jesus! He's a dead eye, ain't he? This thing looks like I can take it. It's just screaming to be touched. But apparently you can't take it. I heard that the factory that makes the big chocolate Easter bunnies here in PA, like, blew up or something? Like, it's freaking wild. I love shooting in VR. It's so relaxing. Oh, oh damn. Oh jeez. But you can also dodge, so that's like a super benefit. You gotta like watch though in like a environment like this because they like being tricky. Flutter my arms. Oh, not enough fluttering. Uh, okay, there's some climby, climby pegs. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Oh. Well, that wasn't duck. <sighs> Parkour. Parkour? More parkour. And up. Oop. So, I saw one over there, and there's one right there. Make sure there's no other ones. That pink one though is going to give me crap if I don't kill it now. Not miss. Oh, I 
missed. Missed again. Oh, got it. Got it. Let's go check it out. Uh, I heard it killed five people, unfortunately. That's really awful. There's nothing in there that I can take. Be sure it is. Well, I guess I can. Uh... That is, but I'm gonna take it. Mm. All right, let's squimmy squimmy over here. I feel like the Jaws music should be playing. Boosh! Remember, folks, use two hands to shoot. And we got the pegs. Too fast. The graphics on this game are very, very nice. I think this thing was like 30 or so gigs. Ugh. Alright, so now we got legit parkour. Where there's consequences if I fall. So, here we go. So far, so good. Does it make sense to jump to that? Oh, I didn't see that. Okay. Oh. You know... Falling right now would be really awful. So let's hope we don't do that, right? Uh, the name of this game is Hubris. It is for... It's available on Steam. Under their VR titles. I am running this on my Oculus Quest 2. But my PC's playing it and I'm streaming it from there to my headset. Uh, through the air link and it works really good um, as long as you have a nice setup network that's on the if you have your 2.4 gigahertz range and your 5 gigahertz range separated out um, you should have no problem running anything through your headset so this is gonna be fun oh no 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 this, wait oh okay so what do I need do I need to go down I don't necessarily need to be on that. I think I have enough squids already. Hey! <laughs> yeah. We got ourselves a goober. So, let me just on that. Take my goober, slap it in the hole. I'm gonna call them goobers. Oh. ka -ching. What do we got? Oh, I'm live under Fortnite? Aw, oh, shucks. Well, no wonder. People are gonna be like, what are you playing? Uh, let's change this to title of
the sheer hubris. The... Game VR. Category. Um, VR? Is VR... VR home? No. I guess I just put it as category hubris. Oh, look at there. There it is. Okay, cool. Done. Alright, is that better? Oh, Renee Paul! <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you, Moochie Pie. Thank you, I. Okay. Time to take my curve the frog arms and traverse the land. Um Okay. Ooh, got something. There we go. Like jungle gemming. Gotta work my quads. My lats. You even got reflections. Check that out. Woo. Well, I don't have any interest in. Alright, I, I, I kind of want to see what's going on down here. Look fun. Uh, nah, nah, nah. Oh. Oop. What the heck was that? Was that me? I think I just. Yeah, I'm just fire, dry firing my gun. Yeah, that's what it is. <sighs> Little waves in the pool. Darn it. Got one. Got two. I don't think I can eat while I'm in the water, but I don't think I'm going to get hit anymore. Am I going to drown? No, I'm not going to drown. I, if, if you're watching from the beginning, they said that I don't have to worry about air when I'm underwater. There's no air meter. It's covered in my helmet. Blowing stuff. Got him. Sometimes they like putting stuff behind you too. Alright, up we go to the hole. 
I guess that terraformer over there is messing with the gravity. Hmm, probably one of its arms is underneath those rocks. Let's help her roll off this planet before the terraformer is activated. Well, you got floating rocks. Maybe you can dive underwater and see if you can free more of those rocks. Free the rocks. Use them to jump. Platforming. Give me my gun. That one. Uh, there's another one over there. Guess I have to get closer. I think there's probably like one more. Yeah. That should be everybody. There's no animals in here, right? Should be it. Mm. <sighs> okay, so there goes the suspense. I I don't even know what kind. There won't be any suspense, but you will get some comical. Uh, stylings of me struggling to platform with with these controls because I have to jump from here to over to there I don't even know if I'm supposed to go that way I mean I would assume it's supposed to go this way but eh. all right so yeah I, I just totally missed my jump cue there again This is the jump button, right? Yeah, that's the jump button. All right. Ah. Oh. And could I just like stand on one of those rocks and shoot it beforehand? Like that's kind of like pointless. All right. Run. Whoa. That thing looks like it's off a of halo, honestly. Mm. I really don't like you. Yeah. Oh, did I just... Oh, what in the heck? Oh, I just threw a whole bunch of stuff out of my backpack by swimming like a crazy person. That's annoying. Did I throw anything else out? You know, this kind of works because it feels... Like, with the Oculus on, it feels like you're wearing, like, snorkel goggles. It's kind of... Kind of similar. was that? Okay. I want to ride it and annoy my friends by running them over. Ride what? Are you still talking about that VR treadmill thing or something else? Why? I'm never gonna make this. I might as well just end the stream now. This is so annoying. No, we mustn't give up. I guess this is why this game's called Hubris. Okay. 
what in the heck are those things? I don't like that. They look like ticks. Okay. Put the plant. Plant in the hole. Plant in the hole. What does it say? Snacks. Do I put this in this hole? Is this? I don't like those things, whatever they are. Ooh. Do we have any more? Do I have to put more stuff in? Because I could use another one of those. Can I eat this? It's fruit. Gross. Alright, I don't have a gun. And there's a whole bunch of these weird little tick things. Don't eat that. Yeah, I'm just gonna eat random stuff on a alien planet. Let's see how that goes. Yeah, no, 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 no. No, I'm good, I'm good. Thanks. Thanks. Uh, I don't need any literature. Alright, I'm gonna go to this person and grab their gun. This uh, here. reload thing is out of the mind. Of Maybe we find something in space for it. Alright. Wow, they do quite a bit of damage. Good to know. Alright. Come here, Pine Cup. Dead trooper. Hey, that trooper's gun over there? Could come in handy. I guess I don't have to tell you those bugs are deadly. That looks rotten. It looks like looks like a banana. A banana pear. Or banana pear with some mute fruit. 40%. Oh, so good. Go touch grass. That ah, grass is for losers. Is there any more stuff over here I can go grab? Can I just touch the button? Give me fruit. What looks like, oh, there? Yeah, well, how do I move this crane? Do I push it? I don't even know. Nope, can't push it. Uh, there's no jumping. You only have to find a way to move that container handler. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of what I'm looking for. Ah, I see. There's a ladder. Oh, I'm gonna run out. And up we go.
I'm a big boy. Service entrance opened up. Now, let's get down there. Yeah, let's. Alright, I think that's where we're going to stop today. It was fun. <laughs>